We are getting a closer look at a wild chase that ended in a crash last week. The chase lasted seven miles, reached speeds of 113 miles per hour. Fox 6's Ashley Sears here in studio. Ashley, that's not even the wildest part. No, not at all. Check out this video here. Officers pulled the SUV over for suspected drug dealing. Two men listened to commands. A third in the back seat had another idea. A traffic stop at the entrance of Interstate 894 in Greenfield starts off like any other. What's going on, boss? Go on the window. Officers pull over an SUV for suspected drug dealing at a nearby motel. Oh, who was the female that came up to the car, though? Greenfield police take a look around, spotting three men in the vehicle. You want to do me a favor and step out? The driver and front passenger do what officers ask, getting out of the infinity. Is that door not open? No, no, okay, that's cool. No, 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 he's taking off, he's taking off, taking off. Investigators say 32 year old Rakeem Hogan is the person seen hopping into the driver's seat and taking off. Go on, go on, go on, go on. For seven miles, squads chase after him. It's the backseat passenger that fled. We don't have him ID. Speeds are 100. The chase moves from I-43 to Milwaukee City streets. I think he just crashed, 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 crashed. It comes to a halt at 25th and State. The driver is seen running from the mangled car. He's trying to jump a fence. He's eventually arrested nearby after a traffic stop turns out to be anything but routine. I'm amazed he got out. Investigators say they found drugs and a gun in the SUV. Hogan has been charged with multiple felonies. He's being held on a $30,000 bond.